Welcome to, to me games, where we play <laughs> me all the time. Don't play with me, but we play me. <laughs> Are we done? No. So this is my group. I have Batman. I have all the classics, you know, Batman, Ghost Rider, The Joker <laughs> Tripped, <laughs> uh, Jack Skellington, uh, Ed from Ed, Ed, and Eddie. <laughs> Uh, I'm in it too. Yeah, she's in it too. <laughs> now, what's that abomination you made right next to Schnitzel? Where? Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Olga. <laughs> Isn't she pretty? Just the prettiest. Hey, wait, wait, where's the other one? Oh, uh, Barfy? Oh, yeah, this is Barfy. <laughs> <laughs> made Wario. Made SpongeBob. And... Okay. <sighs> Welcome to the show. Why am I next to Quagmire? Quagmire is like being really creepy. Like, Quagmire won't stop following her throughout this whole thing. When she was made, he kept like staring at her menacingly. Like, <laughs> you gonna be mine? <laughs> Whoa, Radio Town. <laughs> Whoa, this is pleasant. I'm gonna turn this down a little bit more. That's not a language. They talk like that the whole time. At least it sounds better than iCarly. True. <laughs> and it's prettier than iCarly. You don't have, like, oh, yeah. hair going through people's stomachs. <laughs> like, fucking, uh, I'm trying to think of another game. I mean, like, Sonic Boom, surprisingly, is, is like, a little bit better than iCarly, too. Sonic Boom is the... Oh, it's a dragon. You didn't actually listen to the story? Controlling the very fabric of existence, this wolf stood up. <laughs> against the beast many times its size and banished the darkness. <laughs> it's all painted, I like this. This ethereal wolf's valiant act ushered in an air of tranquility. The villagers' hearts swelled with respect and adoration of the wolf. And penis. <laughs> <laughs> Whoa! We're fighting things! So, I've never played this game. I've always wanted to because I've seen him in, like, games like fucking Capcom vs. Marvel. He's running. He's got a disc on his back. It's his weapon. <gasps> a frisbee? So badass of an opening, actually. You like the music, too. Oh, yeah, I love, like, this Japanese culture stuff is probably Chinese, I'm probably just an idiot. But <laughs> <laughs> they find it very cool, this Asian culture stuff. Made in 2006 and rights reserved in 2008. <laughs> what? <laughs> Excuse me? Oh, Kirby! <laughs> Didn't we just do that? Oh. Didn't realize I was playing Nardo. <laughs> I can skip it if you want. No, I don't. I like this. Don't. Oh, okay. The whole point of this is story. Didn't we just see this, though? I think so. Hmm. Um. Long, long ago, a tiny hamlet known as... Kan Kamiki? Kamiki laid nestled in a grove of proud and beautiful cherry blossoms. Each and every tree around the quiet burg was honored as a god. However, the village was not without its dark secrets. Like that cave that's back there. Many teenagers have gone in that cave. <laughs> <laughs> to sedate the appetite of Oro Orochi? A fearsome cave dwelling beast. Oh, I wasn't too far off about that cave. A young maiden was offered as a sacrifice. With the annual, with the body like a mountain and the heads mounted on necks of the size of tree trunks, its blood red eyes alone were <laughs> cursed. Any anyone gazed into them, no one dared disobey the horrific beast. <laughs> how's my uh, how's my narration doing? <laughs> it's good. When the night of the sacrifice drew near. When the night <laughs> When the night of the sacrifice <laughs> Mysterious White Wolf appeared. Nurse Wolf cut his burn as snow. <laughs> was dubbed she I, 
I it's can't okay. say that. <laughs> it's okay, Tim. <laughs> the wolf we kept a watchful eye on anyone who ventured outside the village and made a habit of patrolling the streets at night. The fuck you doing, kid? <laughs> <laughs> People seen the wolves to be familiar with o Orochi. They were fucking wrong. <laughs> <clears throat> That's racial profiling, you bigots. <laughs> One villager took it up upon himself to face the fearsome Shirani. The warrior Nagi attempted many times to challenge the wolf, but his attempts were thwarted by Shirani's swift movements. Thwarted? Thwarted? <laughs> thwarted. Thwarted. What does that, that mean? It means to, um, to, like, disrupt. His his all his attempts were disrupted, were stopped. But like, the, the long heart. before the night of the accursed, a white plumed arrow heralded coming, piercing the sky. The arrow sunk its shaft squarely into. <laughs> Just like that, the home of Nami, the village's most beautiful maiden. Naki honored, harbored the secret love for Nami, determined to put an end to Orochi. Orochi's <laughs> travel. That that shadowing doesn't even look right. <laughs> <laughs> I don't even know what's going down with the shadow. I'm just. I know I'm not comfortable with it, and this game should be rated M. <laughs> the moon came to a place as dark because evil itself served as. I mean, who's to say that's his sword? <laughs> who's to say it's not his other sword? <laughs> Orochi's home, and Nagi stood. A beast appeared, eyes glowing crimson, upon three, th eight thrashing necks. <laughs> Orochi stood tall before him. Nagi looked with incredible grace, swinging his dick valiantly. <laughs> <laughs> on and on, he sliced and smashed his penis into the moonlight, the moonless sky. <laughs> but Orochi hid like steel. The blade left a very, left nary a scratch. That means it didn't leave a one. His dick was that smooth? It just hears go. It's <laughs> 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 <is> like. <laughs> being across it, this steel. Dropped to his knees, fatigued and grasped for breath as he continued sucking this eight headed thing's dick. <laughs> and then <laughs> the wolf appeared as if to protect Nagi. It stood its ground before Orochi. In the darkness of the cave, the wolf's coat shone brilliantly. Alas, it was. Fuck the wolf that dwelt <laughs> inside the village, bearing its fearsome claws, Naragi's or whatever the fuck. <laughs> Orochi reared its terrified heads, readying its fangs for battle. The two beasts struggled wildly, Am thrashing I going too in the fast darkness. For you? No, you're not, not at all. This is perfectly <laughs> fine. <laughs> I'm like way back here, and it's still picking me up as a fucking booming voice. <laughs> Mysterious and terrifying, the spectacle Nar Shirami summoned just the divine wind to counter Orochi's flaming dick. See that circle? That was his penis. <laughs> it was right there, and you just couldn't see it because he has a, a fucking tic tac dick. Wait, wait, how long is this gonna go on? Orochi closed on, on Shirami as long as it needs to. Sharp claws, giant tree suddenly sprouted <laughs> forth, shielding the wolf. <laughs> Shirani fought gallantly to gain the upper hand, however, Shirani, protected by a mysterious power, was not easily bested. Shirani covered its gashing, majestic coat, dyed crimson. What's up with the voice? I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> Sun, it's my narrator voice. <laughs> Sun exhausted before the mighty Orochi. <laughs> See, because I'm not here, it's a different narrator. <laughs> Orochi saw a chance to strike what would be the most the final bro in a brilliant pose, but Shirami <laughs> refused to give in with its last ounce of strength. The majestic wolf grazed heavenward and unleashed a mighty howl. <laughs> <laughs> so mighty. So, yeah. <laughs> Reminds me of like of Lion King. <laughs> The light from the gl above glinted off Nagi's sword, the beacon of hope, as he killed the wolf. <laughs> Majestic. Majestic, giant, weird, bladed penis. Guided by his sword, Nagi, who had been taking shelter in the... <laughs> shadows, stood proudly to face his adversary. <laughs> Channel channeling all of his strength into his scarred and battered arms, he leapt ferociously toward Orochi, his sword poised high. 
a gold sword danced in his hands like a puppet on a string. <laughs> okay. <laughs> one by one, Orochi's fearsome hands separated their own, own from their owner. What? He cut his own arms off? Heads. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> I like like how one of them's got like a normal thing, and the other one's got like a doofy like sun helmet. Orochi's broken body collapsed in the lake of his own blood. Damn, this game got dark. In an instant, the curse had plagued the villagers was lifted. As the battle subsided, the sun shone once again in the sky. Sorry. That's okay. Shironi had succumbed to Orochi's poison and struggled to breathe. Nagi scooped the beast into his arms and returned it to Kanamaki. Where he laid it in bed, spread its legs, and fiercely fucked it. Well, this is rated... T. Huh. Blood and gore, crude humor, fantasy violence, suggestive themes, and alcohol and tobacco. Awesome. When they reached the village, the village elder gently stroked the wolf's- Whoa, hey, hold on, hang hold on, on, hang on. <laughs> In response, Sharoni let out a hoarse and pitiful bark. <laughs> <laughs> then the cl then closed its eyes and drifted off, as if into slumber. I don't like how they're sacrificing. I love this the wolf music the and like the artwork. I love yeah. it so much. Peace had returned to Konami Village in honor of Sharoni's heroic. I'm not even saying this right. Anyway, erected a shrine shaped like a penis to <laughs> place on the wolf within. <laughs> erected. Erect. <laughs> Nagi's sword was chiseled. Ch Tsunomi and. Chris and Shinomi placed inside the moon cave. The villagers all looked forward to an age of endless peace. But they were fucking wrong. <laughs> However, this is not the end of the story. Whoa. There is more to this tale than most people know. A hundred years have passed since Nagi and Shironi's heroic exploits. My brother discovered the new avatar. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, exactly. <laughs> And with them! <laughs> wolf spirit named. What's his name? Sharoni. That's the name of the wolf? Yeah. It happened so quickly, <laughs> no one in the village even noticed! I thought it was Nobby. Nagi is the guy or who. Nagi. Nagi is the guy that had the big sword that tried to challenge him. Okay, well, so much I, I was. So I was the only one reading this in a weird voice, so. <laughs> it shows how much I was actually paying attention to your story. You're just like my voice. <laughs> Is this the legendary sword? This is Sharoni the sword that- Oh, it's here. I'll do this in a better voice. Is this- Is this Sharoni the sword? No. No, it couldn't be. It's just a legend, nothing but a fairy tale. Look what you fucking did! <laughs> we shouldn't have- We should have skipped the story. This wouldn't have happened. <laughs> <laughs> you see what you fucking did? <laughs> oh, fuck! You're getting the hell out of here! <laughs> Oh fuck! Oh, I fuck a trapped! Oh god! See, what? if we would have skipped the storyline, this wouldn't have happened! Okay, he's got like, this is like the dragon, so... Oh, he who seeks power! <laughs> I'm gonna be an awesome father. <laughs> <laughs> Speak the words I wish darkness unto the world! I'll fucking kill you! Utter that prayer unto me, and unleash my power! I don't want it, man, this is scary. <laughs> I don't want to, this is kind of scary, I mean, I just was looking for a sword and then this shit happened. You're fucking dead! <laughs> the fuck? Oh god! Oh my god! Nightmare fuel! All I picture from that thing is the thing from Hercules, the Hydra from Hercules. Yeah. <laughs> Come on! Come on, kid! You gotta, you know. <laughs> <laughs> I like how the goat guy actually looked like the actor, actor though. <laughs> it's funny when they do that. Yeah. <laughs> oh! Paw oh, that's not a paw print. What the fuck? <laughs> a horrible tragedy suddenly swept over the land. However. There was only one- there was one village that seemed to escape the terrible curse! The Taino settlement of Kanamki. Village enjoyed the protection of the sacred tree. 
It is here that the real story begins! Hey man, I can't do shit, I'm a statue. <laughs> <laughs> you guys fucked this up on your own. Oh god! No! Oh. Whoa. <laughs> Wood Sprite Sekira. <laughs> Wood. How <laughs> troublesome. That's not a straight <laughs> voice. This is just an edge of prophecy of doom! <laughs> what is just fine to bring about such a calamity? We must act quickly! There's no time. Do you want to do this voice? No. Okay. I'm just too busy looking. My at power is the most trouble the ears I've spent to protect in this area! I don't have much time left in this world! Oh, she is this time! <laughs> <laughs> we are never- Oh, fucking- Okay. <laughs> we are never needed your power! I'm sure you to find a way to pull this back out of the middle of the world! You're gonna break your voice. No, I'm not. That doesn't happen. Why is this happening on my show? Uh, I kinda have to take okay. this. Okay. We're gonna be right back. Hello? Yeah, this is- This is she. Okay, we're back. That's your heaven- okay. <laughs> <laughs> oh wait, that was the wrong voice. Yeah. Okay. Look how awesome and majestic oh, that is. that's awesome. Okay! I'm, um, I'm on Tarasu. Oh, such a lively way, such beauty and grace. The only way I do is such a winner is back to go, is that out there? <laughs> Now. Isn't that what girls do? Do you see her butt? That butt. <laughs> see you, bird, after so many years. <laughs> there is my heart. <laughs> this is boring as shit, man. Crazy, <laughs> 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 Here's the butt of you to take you like a nation out of the sky. I'm gonna give her like a different voice. Such our times, our time and departure of the most of the wars are to come. The devious and vicious beasts. They have us ravaged the fine and wonderful country of Nipta. Yep. Yep. <laughs> but never the circumstances have been worse. And they are at this very moment. Please use your powers to banish the darkness and punish those who would have do us harm? Hmm? Chickle chickle. What is this, boobs? <laughs> <laughs> Something has stolen its way into my. Well, let's continue this story. <laughs> it tickles! <laughs> whoa, 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 whoa. <laughs> what on earth? <laughs> Something fell on my boobs. Where's that cancer? <laughs> you again? So this has happened more than one- it's a mushroom. That's, um... That's a little tiny guy. I don't know what type of voice to do for it. <laughs> I like how the quote, like, little bubbles are bouncing with it. Are you not very my clothes again, bug? Bug? I already did that voice. Bug. I'm a wandering artist. My name is Issun. Wandering artist Issun. I'll show you just how great I am. It won't be very long about it before my great brush. What the fuck? What the? <laughs> Look at this! <laughs> Whoa. <laughs> well, what do you think? You encountered the real thing, no? How do you like the voices? Was it doing anything for you? <laughs> uh, I'm not getting you off very well. Okay, I'll, I'll try a different voice then. You clearly look familiar. This <laughs> is you. He just ate him. Whoa, what do you think you're doing? You're fucking annoying. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> it's feeling like we should never be covered in wolf slobber. 
was your phone? Really? What would my phone be doing with the thing? Um... Keep the mirror scene. Is that correct? What? Yeah, it was my phone. Okay. Don't make me use my prized dick sword, Deku Ugawaru, against you. Denku. Maru means. Okay, so this is definitely Japanese, for once. Um, Maru means boy. So, that sword is something boy. That's just weird. Why is it so dark anyway? Oh, great, God, I'm an officer. Whoa, she's the power of like weird pink flower things. Pink blotches of paint. And her fluorescent. She's got the power of like weird jizz. <laughs> she's very excited. Whoa! Look at that wood she wrecked. <laughs> the trees return to normal, huh? So her girl's saying some weird stuff. The village spirits are being kept inside the fruit. That's the fruit. Go say it would be. Cut it down. The village would be restored. <laughs> it's awfully like, out there if you don't know, use some kind of special power. There's no way you're gonna reach it. This darkness Just is climb really getting. The tree. A lot can happen while you're taking a nap. <laughs> Sound like a threat. <laughs> Oh, we're, we're, we're in control of things now. Whoa. First time ever. Um, well, not my first time. But... No, I'm saying, like, the whole time we played, like, and for the first time ever, you can walk around as Ukami. <laughs> like an E3 thing. Z to examine. That fruit sure is growing on a high place. So we're going to reach up there. So it's some kind of special power. What do I do? Just what do I do? Oh, I can't. What in the world? Something blocking in my still dream. Medusa? Was that the wolf? No, that was Isan. Oh, Isan talks for the little. <clears throat> Where are we? I got awfully quiet all of a sudden. I don't remember weird place. Two button, plus pad, whatever. Look how beautiful it is. You make... You make... Like... Temporary uh, grass when you fall. Your memories will be stored into the mirror. Oh, so that's your save point is the mirror? Yeah. Look into your soul and see what you can find. <laughs> um, what are we doing now? We're jumping like a wolf. Yeah! You. I'm barking. That is the best button ever. <laughs> Is there, is there a button for when you just want to fucking scratch at the door and then you take a shit and then you go back inside and then you go outside again for no reason at all and then you go back right inside? <laughs> is there a button for that? Since you know you're a dog? Okay. Want to be sure there was one? Kind of kind of disappointed there is. <laughs> you can tackle with uh, side... The side wiggle. Side wiggle? Side, side jerk off, yeah. Oh, yes. Doing hot. <laughs> whoa, whoa! Get a hold of that fur ball. Get a load of that. What? Tempting. It's chest. It's a, oh, press the A button. I didn't. I thought he was looking at the plant. I'm like, what the fuck? <laughs> what? Ch whoa! You're telling me <laughs> that wolf can try and <clears throat> Yes. Whoa! I want to be a wolf. I want a triangle jump. Whoa! Holy bone! That's the best thing ever! He puts Breaking bones shit. in a chest. You put chest. You put Breaking bones. Breaking shit! What is this? What is this? Fucking Legend of Zelda? Who do you think you are? <laughs> Looks like the bridge cut out. This shouldn't be hard on me, Tarasi. It's kind of long, I might have a call. Listen, Amy, I ever brought good brush work, good soul, when I say at least something about a brush. <laughs> Sorry. Picture's worth a thousand words. Oh, you can draw a thing? Or See? does he just do it for you? No, we copy it. So we just kind of wiggle waggle? Yeah. We didn't do that, though. We just kind of did it on its own. Oh. Um, 
I... Rush God. <laughs> <laughs> Deadly tides. Do gods, gods are no gods. <laughs> <laughs> So this is going to be an extra long episode, just because we need to get past the tutorial mode here. Or at least we need to get past the beginning. River of Heavens. River of Heavens, they fabled Stardust River. But I'm sure don't see anything like that around here. It couldn't be that the little puddle over there could... It... What did that money come from? That is that bug throwing cash at you for talking to you? Like a really lonely Bugsy, thank you for listening to them. Take my change, you dog slut. <laughs> what is... This is... This is weird. Uh, Fever like, dream. Am <laughs> I going anywhere? No. Maybe turn around? No. I don't know, I don't understand this. You digging a thing and then like the, its holes becoming like cell shaded? Doesn't look like you you point at anything. I don't know. Um, try going up that hill. Okay. Yay! It's so pretty up here. Wow! Look at the stars twinkle. Twi twinkle. <laughs> <laughs> <clears throat> it seems to be beautiful that time, Scott. Hey, look! Those are stars forming a pattern, or is it just me? It's just you, you idiot! No. Okay, I think that's a stretch that four stars make that dragon. <laughs> it's kind of a stretch. Are you doing that? You did it. <laughs> Blah! Looks like I'm not ready to press B and hold A to draw. Okay. So you can press B and hold brush. Hold down A and move it to draw. No, you only gotta get the stars. I was supposed to draw on the missing stars. Oh, you are? That's weird. I read. Oh, okay. <laughs> didn't didn't so, know you were. Because you're like, oh, those four stars make the dragon? Whoa, that thing is cool. It's got a map on its tail. I think it's cool looking, it's got like four arms, and it's like supposed to be like one for every element. That's really cool, I like <laughs> this game. It's got dragons and I like it. <laughs> Thirteen spirits of the brush, once possessed including myself, been scattered across this land of men, and now lie in the disarray- That's sexist, by the way. <laughs> I need feminism. <laughs> Time has come for you to seek and reunite the techniques. Your power is what is needed to restore the dry. Fuck, I drew a little bit. <laughs> <laughs> Next time a shadow's. Well, that dragon has a third eye. Whoa. The power. The power of the dragon and the wolf. I think you have to get 13 of those. I think when he mentioned 13. God of rejuvenation. Whoa. That's what I have the power of. You can rejuvenate, you can like can refresh your skin. I can restore the river of the heavens. No way. <laughs> no way. <laughs> Using my paintbrush. Using my paint. <laughs> Alright, pause it real quick. Next time. Could you pause it real quick? Yeah. Alright, next. <laughs> Whoa, I like the menu screen. <laughs> I like this game a lot. <laughs> Next time on Shadows Games, we're gonna come back to this joyous, like, beautiful game. <laughs> Bye!